Good morning, YouTube. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Or evening, or night, wherever in the world you are. Thank you guys for tuning in today. My name is Clutch Master Flex, and I'm here today to tell you guys a little bit about the future of the channel. That being said, let's go ahead and just start off with a little bit about myself. Again, my name is Clutch Master Flex, but you can call me Clutch Master, you can call me CMF, you can call me Josiah, whatever you like to call me, just be respectful guys, that's all I ever ask, just like I want to be respectful of you lovely people. Look at you, I hope you're smiling now. Anyways, I wanted to go ahead and talk to you guys about the future of the channel, and I know that a lot of my following, which isn't that large, mind you, but... You guys may have found me from different sources, um, whether you're friends or family, love you guys, or whether you may have found me on Reddit where I was posting about my Disgaea Nuzlocke, which I will explain a little bit about, I know I owe you guys an apology, or you may have found me somehow through the YouTube algorithm, maybe even Bayonetta, because I did do a full playthrough of Bayonetta, whatever the case, thank you guys for tuning in thank you if you're following thank you if you're not following it doesn't matter i'm grateful that you guys are watching and i just wanted to give you guys a little bit about me and what i do what you guys can expect from me in the near future that being said we are coining today this whole month it is september 1st and it is not just september it is stream timber that's right clutch master flex is coming back we are coming back with a whole slew of updates and games and ideas that I'm going to be doing for you guys. This is a passion project for me. Um, one of my dreams is to make a video game and because of that, hey, if you're gonna if you're gonna write a book, you need to learn how to read, right? And that's what we're doing here today. I'm going to be I'm going to be playing more video games, showing more content, doing introspectives. On top of that, I plan on doing challenging game runs. Just like the dislock, which I will explain again in a little bit, um, and and just genuine competitive gaming and whatnot. Now, for all of you guys that are looking for high level gameplay, I will not lie and say that I am the best. However, I like to play games. I like competitive games. I like solo player games. I like challenging gameplays. You know, anything to hold me back to make the game a little bit more exciting, a little better, in my opinion. Well. I'm all here for it. And now we need to talk about the elephant in the room. If you don't know about the Disgaea disc lock that I created a while back, good, great. You guys are the chosen few that do not have to be disappointed. And for the people that are disappointed in my failure of a run, let me explain. So about a year ago, I decided to play Disgaea 4, a game that I have never played a day in my life. I wanted to play it, but I missed out on the PlayStation 3, and it was released for the PlayStation 4 to my, you know, to my luck. I, I've played Disgaea 2, i played Disgaea 5, uh, you know, sunk in many, many hours. I love the franchise, and so it was only natural to try and play 4. However, I wanted a challenge, as if the game's not challenging enough. To beat the game with a certain set of rules that would make the game even more infuriating. And it did. And ultimately, guys, I vegeta you. I vegeta all of you. There's one thing a Saiyan always keeps his pride! Guys, I let my pride take the forefront and I quit. I quit, I quit. But I didn't quit. Because quitting is the act of never going back to it. That's right. The dislock is coming back in the near future. I have not worked it into Stream Timber yet, but it is coming. It's in the pipelines. I'm, I'm working on it. I just received my PlayStation 5, which was a very necessary step because one thing I did not lie to you guys about was that my PlayStation 4 did go kaput. Just not immediately. At that time, I was experiencing uh, HDMI issues. Uh, I wasn't being able to connect my PlayStation seamlessly, and there'd be times when I would play the game, and the video would ultimately cut out and then come back in. I don't know if that messed up on the stream or if it was portrayed through the stream properly, and I'm assuming not. But again, it did happen, and finally, during my Strangers of Paradise Final Fantasy um, streams, it just stopped which was terrible big bummer 
and I refuse to fix my PlayStation 4 when I could have just gotten a better, stronger PlayStation 5. And look, after all these years of waiting, I only had to pay $800 for it. Thank you, PlayStation, for now releasing it at a more manageable price and making it more accessible now that I just bought it for 300 more. Anyways, I don't care. Money is money. We're not here to complain about that. I do have a PlayStation 5 now, so this is why I'm taking it very seriously. You guys, I am going to be doing more, more, more content. What does that mean for you? Daily streams. That's right. Daily streams. Granted, this is something I'm going to have to get acclimated to, especially because I'm going to be doing videos. That's right. Not just streams. We're going to be doing videos as well, and not just shorts. I love shorts. I'm going to try and incorporate shorts, but shorts, while they're very fast and to the point, they're not really something that allows my personality to shine. I feel restricted within a minute of time, and as you can tell, I like to talk when I talk. So. We will be doing videos, we will be doing streaming, maybe some shorts here or there, more challenges, more fun, more everything for everyone. So welcome, I hope you guys are excited. In terms of what's on the agenda for Stream Timber, we've got Final Fantasy Crystalline Conflict from Final Fantasy XIV, the new acclaimed PvP that I have been able to grace myself with recently. Maybe I'll put some of that in the video today that's going on behind the montage right here. Maybe not, but look forward to that because I will be doing a certain amount of matches per day in the mornings as a cup of coffee gaming. We'll call it coffee gaming. In terms of my evening streams, that's right, I will be attempting to do two streams a day. That might be a little bit of overkill, but we're going to figure it out whether I'm going to be doing Crystalline Conflict in the mornings on one day, and then we might be doing a solo playing game um, during the evening, but we're still working out the kinks on that, and I've got, I have to find the pro proper scheduling for myself. As I am an adult, I do have a full-time job. And I'm in the service industry, so my dead periods are going to be between 5 to 1 o'clock in the morning. So, late night streaming, early morning streaming, that's where I'm at. I hope you guys are excited as I am. Again, we will be doing Crystalline Conflict, Final Fantasy XIV, Strangers of Paradise, Final Fantasy is coming back. That's right. Unfortunately, all my data was lost on my PlayStation 4. Fortunately enough, I am a gamer, and where things can disappear, things can reappear. So I've already returned back to that point on the PlayStation 5. So you guys get ready for that. The, the, the video in the back right now is actually me playing the game. Uh, so yes, I'm currently back where I need to be. I'm going to most likely put up a video, a catch-up video, where we left off video. Uh, my apologies. Uh, so we will be getting back to that, and I hope you guys are excited about that because I'm loving the game. I think the game is fun, fast-paced. It's very much an homage to all of Team Ninja and, you know, the early 2000s bouncer-like games from the PlayStation 2 era. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Whether it's cheesy, you know, it, it's great. It's great. I'm, I'm enjoying it, and I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. Uh, we are going to be playing through the full playthrough of that I'm not sure if I'm going to do that as a stream or if I'm just going to put out videos at a time as it is level based, but expect it to be done. That's a promise I'm, I'm going to keep. After we're done with that, we are going to move into the hardest level of the game, which is unlock after beating the game. So that's kind of the reason why I'm not sure if I really want to do streams for this because I want to play the hardest version. So that way you guys can see me struggle and rip my hair out. <laughs> But for real, I'm not going to do that. This hair is too nice. Anyways, Strangers of Paradise. Look forward to it. I hope that you guys enjoy it. Crystalline Conflict. I hope you guys enjoy it as well. Also, me and Zamaru Gaming, or Zamaru, if you don't know, he's my brother. We have been trying to do some streams. We're trying to align our schedules as well because we are also streaming Dying Light 2. If you've seen it, on the channel that is what happened there is no audio unfortunately we need to find a time that works best for us but dying light 2 is a game that is very near and dear to us we both started off with final fantasy Ugh, final fantasy look at me final fantasy is always on the break we both started off with um dying light 1 on the playstation 
4 uh, years back. It was the first game we played. We loved it. It highlighted everything what the PlayStation 4 could be. Here we are now, back in the Dying Light universe. We're going to be playing this together, so look forward to that. We are thinking that we might do it on Sundays. Sunday night gaming is always one of the best for us. But I'll update you as time goes. Um, you should see some posts on my social medias in case you're not following. I do have a, um, a Reddit page. I'm working on getting a Twitter because I'm not really a fan of using Twitter, but I'm going to going to do it for you guys so you guys can stay up to date with everything new that's coming on with the clutch master gaming okay and finally we must talk about final fantasy 14 so this is a game that is very near and dear to me i've been playing final fantasy 14 since the day it came out on a pc that could barely run it to the playstation 4 over two different playstation 4s and here I am now on the PlayStation 5 and for this I want to be quick and because I know we're running out of time here I wanted to issue an apology to all of my friends on Final Fantasy 14 this might come as a surprise it may not come as a surprise whatever way you take it my character's name is Bethiel Lemuria I've been playing again since day one and Initially, Bethio was created as one of my original characters, and I wanted to build lore, and as I was building lore, I used Final Fantasy XIV as a tool to further develop my character, and, you know, at that time, I was, I guess, what you would be calling role-playing, you know, I was very serious in the game, but I met friends along the way, and... I could not keep up the facade any longer. Obviously, I am not female, I am male. And yes, it's 2022, we shouldn't gripe about these things, and I'm not. However, I felt ashamed because I was living a lie, playing the game with a lot of my friends who may have assumed that I was a woman, and fair enough, I'm playing as a female character and I never explicitly said I was a man. Although, I must say, I did not partake in any relationships or anything like that. So, I have nothing to worry about there, I just, I feel bad, I feel guilty that I, I wasn't 100% honest with you guys, and so for that, again, I apologize. But, that is neither here nor there, if you guys are truly my friend, which I know you guys are, I know you guys will understand, I just wish I could have told you sooner. But yes, that is the start to every perfect YouTuber's uh, career. Start off with an apology. <laughs> Humility at its finest. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for tuning in. I hope this wasn't too intrusive. I hope you enjoyed this little update. And I hope to see you guys with everything that's coming for Stream Timber. Help me. Help me. Help me stay dedicated to you guys. Help me stay, you know, disciplined with this. You know, it's not about the money. Like, subscribe, comment. I hate that phrase, but it is the YouTube algorithm. And it shows me that you guys like the content that I'm putting out, which is ultimately what I'm doing this for. For the love of gaming, for the discipline for myself, and to give you guys great content from a great person. At least I think I am. Maybe I'm a piece of crap. Who knows? Whatever. Maybe you can laugh at me as I die a thousand times. That's perfectly fine and get frustrated. Maybe I'm going to be the next guy to throw my controller into the TV. Who knows? Probably not. I like my stuff. I like it intact. Anyways, thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Clutchmaster Flex, I am out. See you guys later. Peace.